Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Horizon Zero Dawn. I'm your host, Tyler. We're playing Horizon Zero Dawn The Frozen Wilds, DLC expansion. I've just jumped on. Uh, and I've just checked the map, and there's the new region up the top here. And there's some new quests. Like, there's a couple icons here. We got a new quest, and then another new quest. Now, I assume the quest right near the entrance to the new area is the main quest we're talking about here. So let's mark that. And let's travel. Oop. And let's start this DLC expansion. So, Horizon Zero Dawn. This is a huge future franchise and game in itself for my channel. So this is the first jump in. I did a ton of my plays like at the start of the year when the game came out. But this is officially the start of me doing Horizon Zero Dawn content. A walkthrough of this expansion. Don't know anything about it other than seeing that first trailer. I've avoided all spoilers. I've avoided all other gameplay demos. Everything. I've wanted to go into this blind. So here we are. Pretty blind. So I'm... Oh god, I'm so excited. I've been working the last two days. I haven't been able to play it since it came out. But here we are. 36 hours behind it, but here we are playing and I'm oh, so excited to jump back in. Have a little break from Origins, non-stop been playing Assassin's Creed Origins, as many of you know that watch this channel. So just excited to play something new, something different. And to me, the game of the year, Horizon Zero Dawn. I'm drinking coffee, it's like 6.30 at night, but I just finished work and I need to stay awake. I need to be ready for recording videos, so... That's why I'm here. That's why I'm drinking coffee right now, even though I shouldn't be. I haven't played this in a while, so I need to kind of rejuvenate my control schemes. Oh, I'm out of, like, so much ammo. Because I was busy getting achievements. Uh, I do that again. I do want so much or trophies, I should say. There. Again, been playing too much Xbox. Okay. So I think there's a new... I believe... There's a new skill tree. Is this the way to their territory? I think it is. Because I think there's a new level cap. Because I'm max level. I'm level 50. Yeah, there's a new skill tree. Traveler. Okay. Oh yeah, well it says current level 50 and then 50,000 to, I guess, level up. Maybe it's like 60 is the new level cap. So, mounted pickup. Gather resources and search down enemies while mounted. Let's do that. Shard Salvager. Deassemble resources and modifications into 50% of their metal shard value. Sure. Mount repair. Repair a damaged mount using metal shards. Increased chance of loot, skins, bones, lenses, and hearts. Let's do that. What do I want down here? So. So we got Hoarder, increase resource inventory slots, repair any overridden machines using metal shards, that's pretty good. Increase mount health and repair speed, press square to launch a jumping attack from your mount. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's do that. Wait, why can't I get that? Can't learn requires machine repair. Mount repair? Oh no, I need machine, the machine repair. Okay. So I can do both of these now. So I must need, I guess I need to level up to get, to get the rest of these. Okay, that's okay. Now let's get this started, right? How do I get up there? I climb. Sounds about right. I really have no idea what this story's going to be. It's going to be all new. Follow the blue lights, I guess. Oh, so good to be back here with Aloy. You don't look like you know this path, Hunter. I sure don't. Why don't you tell me, love? Seems you're a long way from anything. Where does this trail lead? For me, it leads south. Away from the Banook. Past the grave horde. Banukai, watch over me. This is the quickest way out of the cut, instead of going all the way through Osaram territory. And take it from me. You want a quick way out of the cut. 
I haven't even arrived yet. Why would I want to leave? Strange machine attacks? A curse on the mountain? It's enough to make me look forward to Meridian. Okay. The cut? Yeah, what's the cut? What kind of strange machines? And what kind of curse? Machines tougher and crazier than anything in the south, I heard. And smoke comes off the mountain like a funeral pyre all day and night. But like I said, I just pass through now. Okay, what's the cut? What sort of place is the cut? It's on the edge of everywhere. The edge of Bon Or, the edge of the mountains, the edge of other tribes' territories. It suffered in the war with the Karja. But it suffered before that, too. Life there is a test to survive out on the edge. Not exactly homey. I can see why you'd want to move on. <laughs> Home is what you carry in a roll on your back. Well, thanks for the warning. I'm curious about these machines, though. And the warning rolled off you. I understand you adventurers are all alike. Good luck. Thanks, Eureka. Okay. Into the Frozen Wilds. That's the quest I want. Level 30? Well, fucking easy shit, then. Let's do what it. What are you doing, Eloy? This path leads to the cut. Silence? But you have nothing to offer besides useless mysticism. The eclipse won't stand idle while you waste time playing in the snow. Return to your desk. Surprised you're still checking up on me. I thought you had moved on. Well, forgive me for still being concerned with the fate of the world. I was thinking, Vanuk shamans thread blue cables through their skin, right? Kind of like someone else we know, huh? So maybe the real reason you want me to stay clear of the Banuk is to stay clear of your past. It's not the past that concerns me, Lord. It's the future, or possible lack thereof. Which is why you should stop prattling and get back to what matters. But as usual, you'll do as you wish. Mm. Touchy. <laughs> I guess this is set before the end of the actual main campaign. Because I was like, why is Silence here? Spoiler alert. He's not really talking to you by the end. Well, is he? I don't know. He's kind of doing his own thing, isn't he? I was just kind of surprised he was checking up on us. Without spoiling the end. Just trying to get familiar with the controls again. Oh, yeah. This one's a new predator. I can see the heat coming off it. Jesus Christ. Yeah, what is that? You're not doing shit to me. You ain't shit, bro. Jesus Christ! Yeah, you ain't shit. Uh, what? Excuse me? You're sp when I do a heavy shot, you're supposed to fold it. They shoot fire? Dude, this is crazy. This is crazy. Oh, uh, yeah. This is not, not what I'm used to, I must say. See, I've got an ability when, when, uh, when I do a heavy attack, the, the, the machines are supposed to go down. But this one isn't. This one doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, this one's fucking me up. This one is fucking me up. Let's drop it. Drop it. No! Bad machine! Bad machine! Oh, almost got him. Almost got him. See you later, bro. What the hell was that? That thing was scary. Oh god. Yeah, I don't want it. I don't want I don't want any of that. I don't want any of that for a while. <coughs> All right. So let's keep going. Uh I definitely don't want any of those machines messing with me again. That was not a lot of fun. Whoa. This
This is gorgeous. What are these blue lights? Other than, I guess, the... The trail. Guiding the way. Just the night lights. Okay, we're getting... Oh, shit. Hell? Oh. Okay, that's a welcome, I guess. Yeah, that is a... <laughs> I was gonna say, I was like, well, that's better than shooting at me, so... I guess I'll take that. Let's see what's inside. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The Frozen Wilds. Let's do it. <laughs> you sure you'll be warm enough up here, Nora? I've worked up a sweat from the climb. I'll be fine. Don't you worry about me, Banook. But it's pretty fucking cold. You made it to the cut, Outlander. Not that you'll stay long. Whoa. Smoke rising from the mountain. The village too. What's it for? What the hell is going on? Yeah, it's a bit chilly. Our shaman has abandoned us. Our chieftain has led our best to their deaths. It doesn't sound like the Banuka are doing too well up here. I mean, I don't think anyone would be doing that well up here. It looks like shit. Trust Aurea, they say. She'll return to us, they say. And yet here we are, waiting. Okay. Must be something big going on. Most of the village is moving towards that smoke. Towards the smoke? Is that... Looks like a volcano. Other than the red lightning. It's starting to make me think it's some sort of machine. Oh, shit. Oh, they're all down here. Well, that hurt a lot. What is going on? Ready for a rare sight, Nora. Bergrin, purveyor of necessities. Most of the time, the Banuk burn their dead. But not today. Because the bodies couldn't be recovered. Aye, a nasty business. All their best warriors lost. So they're getting a different kind of send-off. That's depressing. Is that it? Is that like a minute silence now? <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck is going on? You invited these things here? Is it like an offering or something? Wow. Grasp your grief, my hunters, and kill it. For our kin seize the fate all Banuk long for. Falling with their spears striking steel. Their struggle is over now. 
You have witnessed their spirits rise up into the blue sky and beyond the blue light. But our struggle is only beginning. Soon, we will again take up the hunt against the demon that frenzies the machines against us. Demon? And so I ask you, can you summon the courage of our fallen kin? Will you fight and die as well as they did? No! 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 Enemies are prey. The daemon. That frenzies the machines. Machines that wiped out their best. And what do they want to do? Go back up there. Fools. A little advice uh, for free. Uh, I'm with you, Bergrand. Aloy. Aloy. I've been up here for two long winters, and I still can't make sense of the Banuk. Take this ruckus. It started with one of their shamans, uh, Orea, spouting on about spirits and demons up on Thunder's drum. So they march their Warwick up there, and half of them get slaughtered by machines. When Orea vanished, I thought the crazy might have gone with her, but no. Here's Big Aritok, gearing them up to do it all over again. The Banuk. What is it about the Banuk you can't make sense of? Hmm. Well, everything's a test to them. A hardship to endure. A challenge to survive. Seems like they don't have much of a choice in a place like this. Yeah. A land cold enough to crack teeth. Filled with wild animals. You'd think they'd accept a little reasonably priced aid. Well, believe me, I've tried to convince them, but a Banuk with nothing left to prove might just lie down and die. And Orea is the one who spoke about this daemon? That's right. Told Aratok and the others that it lives up on Thunder's drum, and they believed him. But you don't. <laughs> Look, I don't know what Orea found up there. A shaman's not going to talk to an outlander. The machines in the cut are getting more vicious, that's a fact. It could be because of the daemon, or it could be because they all got indigestion, for all I know. But Araya's not around to explain. She took off, and no one knows why. So she's not dead. How about Aratak, that pretty Is Aratak angry dude? Is a renowned warrior around here? He's a Warwick chieftain. His voice carries a lot of respect. Not that you hear much of it. Man talks about as much as a dead fish. But when he and Araya came to town with their Warwick, it drew more Banuk to this little bird than I'd ever seen. Know what else I saw, Aloy? My own little trade route, stretching all the way back to the claim. Then, he goes and leads them off to their death at the claws of angry machines. Uh, so much for my best customers. How about Silence? Give me some details, bro. Have you ever heard of a man named Silence? Tall, deadly serious, cables in his skin? Like a shaman? Hmm. I've heard that name once or twice, but always whispered. Like some boogeyman the Banuk want to forget. I'm not sure what went down, but I got the impression he messed with the Conclave. Or they messed with him. Conclave? All the most important shamans gather in Banur from time to time to keep up with the latest mumbo jumbo. <laughs> no idea how they all fit into one tent without those crazy headdresses getting locked up on each other. Aurea's been to that shindig, but when I asked her what it's like, she just gave me a dirty look. So if you want to know more, you'll have to find her and make her like you, I guess. Good luck. Yeah, I'm not sure what... what this thing is. The I want demon. to know more about this daemon. Mm -mm, it's daemon. crazy talk, Aloy. Or there's something to it. Something connected to how the machines behave. Then you need to find Aurea. She was last seen headed for the mountains they call the Ice Rats. I've heard only the shamans know the trail beyond those frozen peaks. Mm. But I do know where you could find her apprentice, Naltuk. 
He went north of the river, chasing rumors. Rumors? Not the good kind. Sudden attacks in the snow. Strange new structures. Some say a new machine, like no one's seen before. Well, now I'm definitely interested. <laughs> Thanks for the talk, Burgrind. Don't mention it. She is mate, my boy. It's been ages. Let's get some new quests. Okay, so we got a couple of objectives here. Find an old took. Talk to our attack. Yeah, let's do that. Let's talk to old mate. I do not want to hear this talk from you again. Doubt is heavier than a week's snow. Forgive me, my chieftain. We will be ready for the next attempt. But this will not be an attempt. It must be done. Do you understand? My chieftain. Good. Outlander, I suppose you wish to speak. Yep, tell me about the daemon. This daemon you talked about. If you are hardy enough, you can venture out and see the signs yourself. It has changed the machines, made them fiercer, stronger. But what is it? A matter for the shamans to debate. Okay, well... That doesn't do anything for me. Um, Araya. Araya knows about this, Damon. Where would I talk to her? She does a shaman's work. That is not for the eyes and ears of others. Certainly not an outlander's. Fuck off. Fine. There are other Werax in Song's Edge too? Yes. The village has its own life for all the Nuku need trade or shelter. After the war ended, it sprang up from what was once a campsite, quick as the bloom between frosts. Perhaps it will last until the Karja seek war again. Well, I guess that's it then. Good. Prefer deeds to words. Right. <laughs> so I just want to love Aloy. Like, she's so. There's just this soft and caringness to her whenever she meets these people. Like, she actually gives a shit about helping him. I just love that about her. And she's just a badass. Okay. Let's go first things first before anything else. Okay. If I want to learn more about how this daemon affects the machines, I've got to find Aurea. And to do that, I need to talk to her apprentice who followed the river north. Yep. First things first, obviously, you need to do that. Talk to the apprentice. But I want to do the tall neck. Or for you, Assassin's Creed fans, this is pretty much a viewpoint. Where the fuck is this tornado at? Oh, it's frozen. Oh shit. Let's go. Let's try to avoid damage. Oh, this is cool. Frozen tornado. That is sick. Okay, how do I... I'm supposed to unlock the tall neck. Um... Oh, I'm gonna kill... Oh, shit. Kill the scavengers. Oi, bro. Get the fuck out of here. That's what I thought. You get down here, you fuck. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Oh shit. Yeah, you fuck off. Oh. Looks like you're going down too, mate. Yeah, come here, bitch. Come here. And you're mine. That's what I love about having this armor. With uh, the shield on it. You can actually really take more advantage of the melee combat system. Oh, shit. Hey, bro. You're mine. Thank you. I wonder 
wonder if my focus can pick anything up. Good point. Legit point. Looks like the scavengers ripped out three major parts. If I could bring them back, maybe I could even look. Could have looked inside its head. On the tonic array. Okay, I'll scared about losing some serious health there. Okay. So the scavengers have fucking took it! Taken! Oh god, good English, Tyler. Good English, bruh. Thank you. I'm just gonna, don't worry about me. No stress, don't need stress. Oh, okay, maybe a little stress. Demon machine! I'm very rusty at this game right now. It's been a long time since I played. Oh god damn it. This thing is running all over me. Hey fuck off. Fuck you. Thank you. God damn it. That didn't do enough. That did not do enough. Don't worry about me. If you, just, if you could just stand still for me, that would be ideal for me. No, that was a big miss. If you could just stand still, that would be ideal. Oh yeah, that's not, that's not gonna, that's, look mate, this isn't gonna work, if you could, please stop. Yeah, this is not gonna work for me, it's not gonna work, I'm afraid. I'm gonna need you to just stand still. Wow, you need a, god damn, you need a lot to stay down. God damn it. Okay. Those scorches are fucking crazy. They don't give a fuck. They're angry. Oh, sorry. It's my bad. Didn't mean to startle you. No, nope. please just give it to me. How many of these do I have to kill? Blue gram is a rare valuable resource traded to special merchants for extremely powerful weapons and armor. Okay. I will do. New loot, I guess. New weapons. Buy it. Thank you. Oh, headshot. Double kill. No, single kills. Just one kill. Um, what? Oh, fuck me. Yep, come down here, please. So we can be friends. Oh, 
Looks like we have a few new friends, don't we? Come down here. Oh shit. Can you guys just leave me alone? I just wanted to have fun. Oh, not a watcher. Fuck off. That's embarrassing. You're mine. You're my new friend. You get to hang out with me for a bit. Don't go yet. Oh, got him. Okay. This is seriously taking forever just to do a... A damn tall neck. God damn it. Oh, I've missed that. I have missed that. Where the hell am I going for this thing? Oh, you're, you're mine. Oh, it was in that one. They fell down the cliff. Yeah, I'll take that. Let's head back. Now we can get to work on this tall neck. Well, that hits. I hope it works. We'll soon find out. Well, it's in better shape than it was. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, that's not what we want, is it? I think we've got this halo, I think we're good. Oh, down there? Okay, come on, that was weak. Oh shit! Oh shit, he's waking up! Got him going, that's awesome. Now we're gonna climb him. Now I need to climb that tall again. I need to find Run, Aloy, run! This should be a good spot for jumping onto the tall neck. And now we gotta fucking wait for him to come around again. Easy, easy, easy. Okay, so where this flag is, I can run up. Nope. I should be able to jump onto the tunnel from here. Jump! Oh, got him. Alright. Now I just have to reach its head. I think we got it now. I think we're safe. I shouldn't say that, because then we won't be safe. Alrighty. Okay, we're good. Ladies and gentlemen, we are good. Tall neck activated. Oh, 